welcome back to my channel if you are new here my name is Janae Kiara and thank you for clicking on my video today I'm gonna be doing my makeup for you guys I tried to copy this look from Nicki Minaj I am obsessed with it I didn't have the lipstick that she used but this is how the look came out so if you guys want to see how I created this look, then just keep watching. Okay, I'm using the NYX Burrell Glue for my eyebrows. I already did one side, so I'm just going to do the other side. I hope you guys can see it. I'm just brushing them upwards. You guys, I put like way too much, so... It just looks like that. And now I'm just going to use this little thing and just go on top so that it can be flat and smooth. It's really flat and then make the other side Flat. Now I'm going to take this Hourglass Concealer And this is in the shade Silk. I really love this concealer Because this is so close to my Actual Skin color It's not like Too white It's not too yellow And it's not like Orange Cause like you try to get it out and it's like spreading all over the place. I'm using this brush. This is 7064 7064 brush from P. Louise. I need some hair clips so I can clip my hair back. Basically, you just go right underneath. That's one eyebrow. I'm gonna do the other eyebrow. Okay, and then like whatever concealer that you have left over, you can just drag it down to your eyelid. That way you don't have to like apply more. You can just use what is already here. Okay, it looks like this. I'm gonna do the other side. blend the rest out with a 
damp beauty blender. I like to just go right here in the middle um, so that, you know, you know what I'm trying to say. Just to take that away. So those are the eyebrows. Um, the look that I'm trying to do is a look that Nicki Minaj had. I'm sure you guys probably already seen it, seen her wearing it like so many times, but I really want to do this. And it looks like she just had like dark brown and then light brown with big rhinestone only thing is that i don't have this light i don't have this light pink lipstick i don't have that mm. i think i'm gonna use this palette this is the morphe Okay, yeah, so it looks like these dark browns are pretty similar. So the brown that she's wearing is pretty dark. So I'm going to use this one. And this is called Full Gravity. And I'm just tapping it. Tapping it like in the crease. So this is going to be in the crease. And hers is like pretty dark. So I'm just gonna keep adding it until I get the right shade that matches the shade that she has. So now I'm gonna like use this brush and I'm just gonna Diffuse it a little bit.
Okay, this is the eyeliner. This is what it looks like. And now I'm gonna add the rhinestones. These are the rhinestones that I'm gonna add with some glue. And with one of these. because I don't want to go any bigger than this. She, I think she probably used like these or maybe these, but I'm gonna use these. And they were like kind of spread apart. They weren't like perfectly in line. So I'm gonna try to do that. Try to get it like as close as I can. Okay, guys, should I wear my hair like this? I feel like this is like a little bit cuter. But now I'm gonna do the primer. This is the Bobbi Brown Vitamin Enriched Face Base, which I need to go get the full size. This is the same brush that I always use to apply it. This um, primer is so good. Like, I'm surprised I haven't ordered the full size one yet. I guess I'll just wait until I use this one all the way until it's gone. And then I'll order the full size one. I'm going to use this foundation. And this foundation is super orange. But that's okay. Oh, okay, it's not that bad. Now I'm going to try this one size beauty. Um, Concealer. This is the Turn Up the Base Butter Silk Concealer, and this is in the shade Fair Three. Ooh, I really like how this applicator looks. And now I'm going to use this Born This Way Concealer. And this is in the shade Short Gray. Now this is like super, super yellow. So we have like orange, yellow, white. We have a bunch of colors going on. But trust me, when I blend it out, it's going to look the way that it's supposed to look, okay?
this is the Mario Makeup by Mario Contour Stick in the shade Medium. The only thing that I don't like about this product is like the packaging is so wobbly and cheap. Like it's so cheaply made and I don't like that. And then this is like a cool brown color. And bring it up like this. And I don't use this on my nose though, but I could try it. Oh my gosh. I don't know what happened. It's okay. I can fix it. Okay. Now, time to blend everything out. And sometimes I see people like spray. So I'm going to do one spray. And then I'm gonna Now that is done, time for the powder. You guys, this is the Huda Beauty Pound Cake Setting Powder. And I don't want to like show it because there's powder in here. Okay, now I'm gonna dust away this powder because I don't really like to bake my powder on my face. Okay, now this is the Charlotte Tilbury Flawless Filter. My door dash is here. And I'm gonna use this. This is the Made for Shade Bronze and Sculpt Trio from One Size Beauty. It's still like pretty new. I don't really use it too often. I'm gonna use this shade at the top. You guys, I'm gonna use this brush. I don't know where this brush came from. I don't, it doesn't have a name. It's not name brand, so. I'm trying to get this nose looking snatched. Middle. 
just need a little bit like that. Now for highlighter, I'm gonna use this. This is the Morphe High Impact Highlighter in the shade called Extra. And take like a really skinny brush and go right in the middle. And it gives it like that illusion to a skinny nose because her blush was like super, super, super pigmented, super pink. So I have to do that as well. And this is the L101 brush by Morphe. This, this brush is literally made for blush. I'm going to use this lip liner. This is from NYX. And this is in the shade. It's in this shade called Stock. Stock Home. Stock Home. I don't know. I wonder if I could like make that lip color. out of eyeshadow. I have this pink lip gloss, but she's not wearing lip gloss. She's wearing like like a really really bright under eyes right like I have this but this is like not at all what she was wearing. This is like dark purple. I guess I could wear this. Hers was light purple. And this is dark purple. You guys, I don't like this. I don't like this at all. Mm. This does not look good on me. Let me put some pink on top. I don't know what kind of glitter she had on the bottom. I can't really see it in that picture, but these are the two glitters that I have that kind of look similar. To hers, this one is silver and this one is like iridescent. I don't know if I should just do the silver or if I should do the iridescent one. I really want to do the iridescent one. I might just do both. And 
this is the finished look. Um, I'm most likely gonna take this lip color off because I don't like it. Oh, let me put some of this like in my inner corner. This is a pigment and it's called, I think it's called white diamond. It just makes the look way better. This is the finished look. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I know that I did. Um, I love you guys. Thank you guys for watching. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.